hello i'm gonna try this one more time uh to do a video on my bedroom and how it turned out so here goes getting ready to walk through the door right here is some lamps that i the candles right here i bought them from walmart I got these from Walmart. They was black. I spray painted them. Then uh, light switches. I bought these right here. The lows. You press them. They come on. And I just spray painted that part right there. And my doors. I did a green and white strip on them. And this right here was given to me by my daughter-in-law's mother and they was black um gold and white and what i did i did i spray painted the black green and did the white then the silver and the lights back here i bought them at walmart for four dollars and they was half price off so i get, really paid only two dollars for them um, this ugly chair right here. Oh my God, this chair is so ugly. When I found it, it was brown. So what I did, I went to Walmart, my favorite store. I bought me a pack of uh, green pillow slips, pillowcases. And I unstrewed the seats and everything and I recovered them. And going up to the wall mirror, I always wanted me a floor mirror. A friend of mine was getting rid of it, so I got it. And again, spray paint. I spray painted it green. Get a little closer. Green. And what I did right here, I took and put some nails in it. Right there. And I hung my necklace on them. So... All my necklaces did being displayed. Don't worry about that mirror there, cause I got to do something with it. And them right there were candle holders on the wall. I got them at Walmart. That was fifteen dollars for two. So I just went on and got two, and I left them black. I wasn't changing them. I was thinking about spray painting them white, but I said I'm just gonna leave it. And my nice sand, the lamp. This lamp comes from America Freight. It was $19. So what I did, I had put it together. It was black and gold. As you can see, some of the gold is still right here. I just hadn't figured out how to do that. But I guess I just tape everything off and go ahead and sp spray paint that silver. But I broke everything down. And I spray painted it white. And this part right here, it was gold. And I spray painted it silver. And there's my TV remote, my home theater remote. Of course, my ashtray because I smoke. And my lighter. And I put some plants there and put some of them little... Rocks look like diamonds. They are diamonds in there. And that's my home theater speaker right there. So I didn't have nowhere to put it, which is supposed to be up in the... A friend of mine gave it to me, and he had it originally screwed up in the ceiling. So I didn't want to put it a hole in the ceiling because I'm renting. So I just stuck it down behind my nightstand. And my bed. Let me go down this way so you can see my bed. This is my bed. Now this comfort set, believe it or not, I got it from Amazon for $49. It came with the two shams pillowcase and the two little square pillows and this, uh, the comforter. For $49. Then, 
again I went to Walmart and I bought me an extra set of um, pillowcases green to go with it to put a little more color into the bed but that's my bed and then over on this side of the nightstand oh the light is not plugged up that's another one of them lamps, lamps I got from America Freight and I spray painted it also white and silver then there's another ashtray and another set of flowers and the speaker back there there's the other um, lamp and these candle holders right here my friend gave me those and they was originally red but what I done I took it as you can see I took and spray painted the silver and splashed it with a dash of green paint and I don't know if you can see up there it says love live and laugh there's the mirror prints with the butterflies and that's my curtains and down here a friend gave me these sticks and I actually left them black and dashed them with some white paint these vases right here they was originally glass blue vases um, a friend of mine passed away and her daughter said that I could have these vases in memory so of course I'm not gonna let go of the vases I love them they came in handy and this actually is two of them there's the other one right there and for the stand I got this stand at um what did I get this stand at uh big lots it was originally $79.99 but I wanted one like this and when I went in there I was shocked to see it uh excuse me it was originally um what they call it grayish gray whatever but I took it and I sanded down stripped it and everything with some strippers some uh, wire strippers my son told me to use some wire strippers in which I did and I had spray painted it once and it wasn't looking right so I stripped it and sanded it until I got the right texture that I wanted and I spray painted and for those down there those was my vases um my room was brown gold and a uh, tan and I just left them the way they was and just put them on up in here which I'm thinking about taking them out and put them in my living room and this stand right here it was at um big lots i got it from big lots what's big lots where did i get it from big lots i think big lots for five dollars six dollars and that's a picture of me when i was at the club i took a picture uh what was that i was at lucky's out of Romulus and the frame got diamonds on it so I think it'll go and match good with this table and then here's another one I got to give me some tea lights to put in it this tea light candle holder it was what five dollars and then I seen on YouTube where somebody had took one of these vases and put some flowers in it and put some water in it I had an idea that I was going to buy me a candle holder and another candle holder and glue them together and make that vase. And I just glued the pearls, pearls and things around them and then take the pearls all up around it and put my little diamond. Yes, I like blinging. Fake it until I make it. 
Then this base right here, I got diamonds down at the bottom of it. And I did the same thing with this one. I took and glued me a lace, kind of hold on to it, and made this. And then I took the ribbons and curled them up. I was going to dangle some pearls from it, but I figured that would be a little too much. So I did the right ribbons and the gold ribbon. And these are, these are just some Christmas lights that I had. And I just tuck them, throw them in the vase, give it a look, pizzazz. And there's the other one that I had tucked and made. I don't know if you can see it that good. I'm recording this with my phone. Um, then I got white shields up to my curtains. And here's the other one other one and I actually got a cam uh, candle in this one because I took the other candle down and started burning it then for this plant right here which is not real but I got it at Aaron's and it was originally $59 but it was on sale so I got it it went number $10 I love budget shopping. Then I went to a um, secondhand store, and I always wanted me one of these vases. And there it is. I said I was gonna get me go in the kitchen and get me two of my champagne glasses and put on each side of it. And what's in this bottle? White grape juice. Make it look like some champagne or some wine or something in it. But it is. What? It is actually white grape juice. And. Put that on there for a little bit of decoration. And there's my mirror. My thing. And this is my stuff that's on my dresser. This little silver pan right here, I got it at um, the Dollar Tree, actually, for a dollar. And I seen on uh, YouTube where I think it was, uh, who was it? Pink Soul Foxy. She had made her one, similar to, something similar to the teeth thing I got over there. But... I didn't want to go through all of that. So I just got that and went to uh, Ollie's and they had these little roses with the rocks and the little diamonds in it. And I put that in there. And then I just set my little perfume and stuff in it. My, my white diamond. I love white diamond. And my, uh, what is this? This is J-Lo. And this is Bash. And this is, uh, what is this? I can't tell, but I think it's a fair. Yeah, it's a fair. And then lovely Sarah Jax, Jessica Parker. And then white linen. But this one is my favorite. Then go on over to this side of my dresser. I have a picture here of this is my mom, that's my uncle, and that's my auntie. And all three of them is gone. So I have them sitting on the dresser so I can keep them in my mind, keep them in my heart. They're always going to be in my heart. And that's my glasses, and this is a gift from Set of Monopolis. And over on this side, I have a candle, which was gold, which you might see the gold sleeping through, but that's spray painted green. Then this candle holder right here, I got it at Big Lots. Yep, Big Lots, and it was $5. I've been had it for about two couple of years. I love it. Then I got me a little scented candle. I never burns it, but it sits in there. 
Then I got this also. This Euro box. I seen it. I loved it. I had to have it. My room was black and silver by changing. I'm always changing. What I have in here? There's nothing in that one. Oh, and this one is a watch that my son bought me about six years ago. This is my Gucci's watch. This is my other watch that my other son had bought me. That's not all my stuff I keep it put up. Then, in this one, this is my mom's bracelet. My sister bracelet. She passed on. And this is my mom's watch. This is my mom's pearl. And this is a ring that the guy that I was going to marry, he passed on. He was killed by a drunk driver. So, everybody had told me I need to get rid of it, but I can't. I was in love with him. And this is just a costume ring that I got at Docs before it went out about two years ago. About a year ago. And never wore it. I liked it. Just got it. And over here is another one of my vases I made. On this one I glued it to this. Then I used the white uh, lace and just glued me some diamonds right there. And this is my home theater system right here. And Macy's candles. Candles in a Macy jar. French vanilla. Love French vanilla. And this clock. I'm, this was actually a picture frame. I took the picture that was right in here out. And this clock came from Ikea for the what, $11? And I just tsk, hot glued it up in there, glued me a plant right there, painted this green, and that silver did me a little picture right there. I love flower. This is what's going to cook the cake, you guys. Yeah. I put some green duct tape, I mean some blue masking tape around my TV. As you can say, I painted it green. And behind my door, sorry about that, you guys. There's an old saying, um, that's Marilyn Monroe saying. It says, I'm selfish, impatient, a little insecurity. I make mistakes, I'm out of control. I'm out of control and hard to handle. But if you can't handle me at my worst, then you sure in the hell don't deserve me at my best. Marilyn Monroe. And I love that. So, I ordered that off of Amazon for what? A penny. Shipping and handling costs more than this did. Then this... Styrofoam, I didn't have nowhere to put my little stuff, so I just took and put the styrofoam on the wall, nailed it up on the wall. You might can't see it, but there it is right there. And I just stuck my earrings in there. You can put them in the, well, my earrings. And... This is another one of my DIY projects. This is actually a window string that goes on your window. And these right here is the blinds. I hot glued them there. Put my butterflies on there. And glued it to my door. And this is why I hang my earrings.
And that's all, folks. And, oh, the canopy. The most of all is the canopy. Oh, my God. I love this canopy. I ordered it from Amazon. It was, what, $34? Shipping and handling was, like, $6. And you actually just put it up in the ceiling. And I wanted it kind of up off the floor a little bit, so... I just tied the draper up around the little hook right there and brought it up off the floor. So, this is my room, guys. Did it on a dime. <laughs> a little bit at a time. And the picture up ahead of, at the head of my bed, it says, relax just be you and these glasses that I have my incense in my liquid incense which they really don't work so I just got them up there for decoration the glasses was a dollar from Dollar Tree the little stuff that's in it I got it from the Dollar Tree huh. just something to make the room look nice And this is my room. Oh, one last thing. The chandelier. I got that at a reuse, reuse cycle store out in Ann Arbor, Ann Arbor. And it was only $3. So I got it and I brought it home. And it was actually gold. And I spray painted it silver. And I always wanted a chandelier. I couldn't afford one, so I get the next best thing to it. It's actually kind of cute. I like it. It's three tiers. <sighs> this it. I'm sorry about the my finger being in the way of the video I very apologize for that and oh um, and there's a little plant a uh, plastic plant that I had bought at Walmart and a mirror just sitting right there on the foot of my footboard and that's it this is my room Thank you. Thank you for watching. I hope you liked the video. I know I made a few mistakes in it, but I very much apologize. And you have a blessed day.